when I was asked to stand up here today and speak a few words at first I couldn't think of anything to say. How could I find it in me? What do I say at a funeral for someone who you feel responsible for letting them die? We all knew you were sick. And we stood by and watched you waste away trying to act supportive, but all we did was let it happen for too long and without enough intervention. And I could act like this was just your moment to go. As if this was part of a bigger plan, but the truth of the matter is we just didn't do enough to save you. Eating disorders have the highest mortality rate of any mental illness. Yeah. Killing 10,200 each year. That's one death every 52 minutes and unfortunately the numbers are only increasing. There are people dying across the world because they don't think they're good enough. They are so ashamed of their bodies that they cannot see how beautiful they are. And why is that? Why are so many of us not able to see anything worthwhile when we look in the mirror? I'll tell you why. Because we are constantly bombarded with an edited idea of reality. Our sense of normal is abnormal. It's not just our appearances, no, it's this control, this pressure that has been mounting since we were little girls to be the thinnest, the tallest, the most tan, the smartest. As if it was easy just to get straight A's whilst being good at a range of outside activities, to go to a good university whilst holding down a good job, and on top of all that you have to look like a fucking supermodel to have a social life at all. <laughs> Fuck this. Fuck social media. <laughs> fuck diets. Fuck Hollywood. Fuck models and runways and size double zeros. Fuck the Instagram girls that don't even look like themselves. Fuck them. I wish I had told you every day that you were beautiful. Just as you are even if you didn't believe me. Because you were. You were beautiful.